Hey everybody, it's Raphael here, and I'm gonna show you how to set up Discord in Linux Mint, all right? So if you're running into this problem, it's because you're trying to use the .deb package. So I'm gonna show you how to set it up in a different way. So in the Discord download page, in the download for Linux, choose tar.gz and save that to the downloads folder or wherever else you wanna save it in. And then back into the terminal, navigate to wherever you saved it. In my case, it was in the downloads folder. Here's my downloaded file. And there we are going to extract the contents to the slash opt directory, all right? So I'm gonna enter in the command for this. So that's the command we gotta enter. And then we need root permissions. So have sudo and then enter in your own password. And then you should get this kind of output, hopefully without any errors. And then the next thing we are going to do is create a symbolic link. So sudo ln-sf slash obt slash discord slash discord and then slash user slash bin and slash discord. And then the next thing we're going to do is also copy this um, discord.desktop file to user share applications. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And like I said before, make sure you have root, you have sudo in front of each command. And then the last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna edit the um the file that we just copied. So we're gonna use the nano text editor, nano slash user share applications, then the discord.desktop file, all right? So here we're gonna also edit the icon and the um and the um executable files. So here the directory is user bin discord, and then the icon is this um directory over here. So it will show us the Discord icon. So it's a PNG file. And now we're gonna save the file with Control X to edit Nano, it's Control X to save. And then you have to reboot your computer for the changes to take effect, all right? So I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, so here we are, our computer is rebooted. And if we go ahead and load up Discord, you can see that Discord is in our menu. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on it. And don't worry if it takes a while to load because it is only true for the first time. So here we go. Um, Discord is loaded up. And trust me that the um, if you load it up any like, if you load it up more than once, it will get faster. So don't worry if it is very slow the first time. Um, it's gonna update some, it's gonna install some updates and eventually Discord should work as it usually does, all right? so. Here it is, now it's detecting our account. And then the login screen should pop up in a couple more seconds. It can take a bit, oh, there we go. So yeah, hopefully this video helped you out. Thank you very much for watching and enjoy Discord. I'll see you soon.